Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. MTG Box Analysis here with another pre-release kit, but this time Murders at Karlov Manor. Let's crack this thing open and see what kind of value we can find inside. So we are going to see the green die and there's the sword. Very cool. All right, drop the die on the floor. So now we're back. All right. So our pre-release card is a niv Missit Guild Pack, but there's a second card behind this, so we'll get to that in a little bit along with the arena code. But for now, let's just go ahead and crack open the play boosters and see what kind of value we can find inside. All right, pack one starts off with a suspicious detonation. Then we're going to see a rot farm mortipede, an escape tunnel, followed by a due diligence, a crime stopper sprite, a fairy snoop. Then we're going to see an on the job with a push and pull split card. Then we get a case file auditor with a no more lies, really good uncommon from the set. Then we're going to see an ill-timed explosion rare with a case of the uneaten feast as a second rare. Then we get an out cold and foil and a standard forest with a detective token. All right, so a double rare pack and a decent uncommon. Let's see what pack number two has in store. Start off with the bu Bubble Smuggler, the Sanguine Savior, the Agency Coroner. Then we're going to see Slime Against Humanity, the best common in the set. Followed by a Novice Inspector, a Thinking Cap. Then we're going to see the Chase is On, followed by a Furtive Courier. Then we're going to see a Soul Intervention with a Fuss and Bother. Then we get a Case of the Flinched Falcon with a Cryptic Coat coming in as our rare. This would be a pretty good hit for us. Then we're going to see an On the Job, followed by an Island and a Clue Token. All right. Got the number one common in the set. Let's shoot for the number one uncommon, which is the Crime Novelist. So we got the Cold Case Cracker, Person of Interest, followed by a Magnifying Glass. Then we're going to see the Loxodon Eavesdropper with the Museum Nightwatch. Then we get the Projector Inspector, Dramatic Accusation, followed by a Private Eye, a Concealed Weapon, chalk outline and a surveillance monitor our rare is going to be an ansrag's rampage coming in followed by a snarling gorehound and foil with a standard swamp and a little old human uh token all right three packs to go gonna see a clue token in the back of this so we got ourselves a magnifying glass another eavesdropper followed by a hasda vigilante Projector Inspector again with a Galvanize. Then we're going to see a Thinking Cap, a Fanatical Strength with a Case of the Burning Masks, Curious Inquiry. Then we're going to see the Lightning Helix, followed by a Vengeful Trekker. Then we get a Niv Mizzet Guild Pack coming in. That's our pre release card, followed by a Perimeter Enforcer and a Mountain. And there's that clue token. All right, two packs to go. This one's going to have an art card in the back, but before we get there, we've got ourselves a Nervous Gardener, another Due Diligence, a Crime Stopper Sprite, Goblin Mask Maker, an Ally Assailant, Bite Down on Crime with a Shady Informant, and then we're going to see the Chase is On in Showcase with a Cease and Desist, then we're going to see Essence of Antiquity with, there we go, the Crime Novelist, the number one uncommon in the set, followed by an Arch Druid's Charm, a really good rare forest. Then we get a Make Your Move, followed by a forest and a non-signed art card. All right, final play booster pack of this pre-release kit, and then we'll get to the arena code. So in this pack, we're going to see a Gearbane Orangutan, a Cerebral Confiscation, Vengeful Creeper, followed by a Gadget Technician. Then we get a Hotshot Investigators with a Rackish Scoundrel, an Auspicious Arrival and Showcase. Then we've got the Case of the Trampled Garden, a Knife, Buried in the Garden, and we're going to see ourselves a Lush Portico coming in from the Land Cycle, followed by Kellen Inquisitive Prodigy, second rare of the pack. Then we're going to see a Flourishing Bloomkin in Foil, with a standard island and a mysterious creature coming in as a token in the back. All right, so let's go ahead and crack this thing open, see what our second card is, and then we'll get drop that arena code on the screen. All right, so there's one more look at niv Mizzet. Very cool. And behind it, we're going to see Tomic, Wielder of Law, uh, Mythic coming in. Very cool. And here is, oh, we got a punch card, pre-punched. All right, whatever. Uh, and here's the arena code. So if you'd claim this, uh, this code on arena, you'll get six packs of Murders of Karloff Manor. All I ask is that you drop a comment to let everyone else know to stop. 
All right. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, do something amazing. Get early access to videos, download the analysis for every box open on the channel, and personally DM me, just like these fine people. All by becoming a member of the channel through YouTube or over at mtgboxanalysis.com. You'll find links in the description. Until next time, do something amazing.